Well, hello guys and welcome here again to a new video and today we're going to talk a bit about how you can get your money out of the Tower ecosystem and onto different blockchains. And if that sounds interesting, well, I suggest you should leave a like, comment and subscribe because that helps out the channel quite a lot. And with that being said, make sure to join the Discord as well as Telegram, link in the description down below. And with that being said, let's actually get started. So. The first things first, if it comes to the Tower blockchain, we've got to talk about Mask Protocol because you now can also withdraw your money from uh, the locked drop and I already did so. I withdrew my Mask and my uh, USD put, I put into the locked drop and that is now in my wallet. And now is the step, obviously, how can you get your money out of the Tower ecosystem? Well, obviously you could use a bridge, but somehow, uh, I don't know why, but I am unable to get my bonded ETH onto the bridge. And that's one reason why I'm not going to show you the way of using a bridge, obviously. Um, how you can do it is simple. Uh, I didn't think about it, but it's still possible to deposit your tower into Binance. And obviously, you need to use the address there and the memo. So uh, you need to have both. And obviously, you can deposit your tower USD. And I'm actually going to do so, but I need to pull up my second screen there to get everything and I'm just going to do a test transaction of around 100 USD simply to show you guys how it's been done. Obviously you can sadly not see my tower station that's because I need to copy the um, memo phrase uh, sadly. If I wouldn't have to do so I could show you how it's done but uh, it will close if I copy it over. <clears throat> but obviously it's a simple transaction. Um, currently it's broadcasted so it has been sent and obviously when it arrives it will show all the recent deposits and we can already start ahead and go refresh and maybe we would already see it pending but no we don't and obviously the step after doing so is searching for UST and then you find UST which you can then trade and exit your position and that's definitely one thing uh, that I forgot actually yesterday uh, that you still can trade it over on uh, Binance and that's one way obviously to cash out your UST. The other way is to do it to the portal token which where you even could bridge over some uh, Luna or UST directly but I don't know if you could exchange them on the other blockchains given the fact that most likely the liquidity isn't there. The best way to do so is obviously Binance but uh, at what, what price point, uh, that's definitely up to you. But here you can see we now received our USD and if we would proceed with selling, uh, we would get from 100 USD, $16 worth of BUSD. Of course, it's almost nothing, but uh, it's way better than having nothing in the wallet anymore. And that's obviously how you can manage and get your money over onto this. <clears throat> uh, into the different blockchain, but at the same not into this blockchain, but uh, overall from the tower ecosystem over onto the Ethereum blockchain or for example the Binance blockchain and yeah that's pretty much how you can do it and now we're going to talk a bit about what the current future is obviously for the channel and what is going to happen with the ecosystem well my humble opinion you can see everything is pushing back and that's most likely simply because people are printing money at the moment with usd by doing insider pumps because everyone has somehow now a lot of usd and a lot of luna and they can definitely manipulate the price and make it go upwards so don't expect uh, so don't uh, never mind but uh, just know that the prices could definitely explode for those tokens over the next few days and it could be worth actually buying some of them uh, but i cannot really recommend anything at this given moment simply because um, there's a lot of uncertainty at the given moment in the market for tower and yeah that's why i'm not going to do any takes on what i would buy or if i'm going to buy anything because it's a pure gamble at this moment i rather would go ahead and uh, gamble more money away in an online casino than doing it over here because there you actually have some control uh, but here you don't and yeah, it's just a gamble at the moment but the future for the channel obviously we will continue to do crypto um, we will find new blockchains. Uh, I already have some in my eyes, like uh, Rune, for example. And obviously, we're going to talk a bit about Ethereum and all the other layer one uh, solutions that are out there. 
uh, and also optimism because optimism definitely will be a key factor also for the ethereum system and what not and yeah it's a lot that will come for the channel so don't be afraid uh, we still got content to talk about we will have focus on Terra, obviously but now we will diversify a bit because we learned our lesson from being invested only into one asset mainly uh, it's better to diversify your portfolio into different assets and we learned it the hard way by almost losing 400,000 but yeah that's just what it is even though we lost that money we know that we only put in 10,000 in the beginning and that's why it's not that bad you know uh, it could be worse we could be uh, already be at zero but we still got some money left from the USD and so on and with that money we can simply build up our way again uh, to a new Altama in our portfolio and obviously if you want to join the journey with me make sure to subscribe and join the discord as well as telegram because um, from time to time we hang out there and talk about some different stuff and yeah if that sounds interesting well definitely do so and yeah we also gonna keep talking about tower updates obviously if there's something new regarding um, what is going to happen we are definitely going to do a video about it because most of you guys were invested into tower as well obviously some of uh, you didn't but that's just uh, a few of uh, a few of you guys most came from the tower ecosystem over and onto my channel and that's one reason why i will never uh, not talk about tower because <clears throat> even though it hurts to watch it uh, it still needs to be talked about and that's one reason why we're going to keep uh, bringing updates on tower as well and there will definitely be hopefully some bright future for it uh, but at this moment we obviously cannot really tell uh, simply because there's a lot of uncertainty and the proposal that we talked about yesterday isn't 100 percent sure you know there's already as i said changes to be made and most likely we're going to see a different outcome than we have at the moment but it's definitely something that i would consider looking into in the forum go ahead post your opinion there what you would like to see for the tower ecosystem and also what you would like to see for the refund because i cannot really tell what i would like to see uh, but yeah it's definitely a bright future i would say even though uh, short term is a lot of pain uh, can be overcome with a lot of positivity and obviously having a community to rely on is very important and i'm very thankful for that so thanks for all the guys who are always in the discord active uh, doing their research as well providing top tier content uh, not only with videos but also with uh, what they write and that's really important but nevertheless uh, that's it for today today a bit shorter because there's not much to talk about current situation but i wanted to update you guys also a bit on the channel so yeah we will see us tomorrow so take it easy goodbye